really good night and uh, looking forward to today. The weather's beautiful, everyone's here, everyone's ready to go, it's great. Uh, sessions day, I mean we're gonna, we're gonna go through five hours of working today, studying. Uh, probably split the team in two, going through IDs, ID generation, so first off, uh, the basics. Good orientation day yesterday with the guys. They've all uh, got over their jet lag now, so now we're going to hit the classroom, get some uh, proper work done. It's been a pleasure being with uh, Anton and the group and now we, we are ready for the hard stuff, probably the reason why we are here, very excited. This industry is all about generating ideas and, and having the timing right. So today ID generation and then next session we'll move into building the portfolio. But we're not going to go deep into the details because we can't share that, I mean it's, uh, it's proper uh, in-house uh, tools. Okay guys, welcome to Cape Town, South Africa, to your three-month mentoring program. We're going to start session one today. We've got four sessions over the next week. And the first session, we're going to start off with the mechanics of trade ideas. So let's get started. I've gone through the box ticking exercise. Now, I like this situation. So now I'm going to go and find out what is driving the earnings growth. So now we go on to the qualitative analysis. So what we're doing now is mechanics. We're box ticking. Because you can't go into the real world and qualitatively analyze every single company on the planet. Right, it's impossible. What you can qualitatively analyze is something that looks seriously interesting that's popped up through your systematic process. Because you're taking a wholesale approach to finding and generating ideas. So that means that when you're mentioning that, if it's not uh, linked with your macro view over the next six months, you don't look at it. See? Let's say Euro dollar is moving, you say, okay, they're making 60% more because of the Euro dollar, but you think it's gonna come back to the mean. This is not a buy anymore, it's probably a sell. So it's, this is the filtering, but you need to look the filtering versus your macro view, your understanding of the world. So, because most of, most of my mentees, they come with ideas. After the first idea, I say, okay, there's something wrong, and say, yeah, I know, I know, but I tried. It, it, it's gonna be your own money on the table. So, when you put your own money, if something is wrong, don't go for it. You know, it's like buying anything, buying a house, buying a car. If you buy a wrong car, you know it already. And the, the stock market or any investment is the same. So when you get a bad feeling, a bad test, you just stop. Don't force yourself into the idea. You need to understand that by the laws of numbers, there are no excuses not to have an idea. If there's 20 stocks in the sector, there's a mean for every one of those variables that we've, that we've discussed. So just by the laws of numbers, there's going to be positive and negative outliers. So what the hell are we doing in this process? if we're looking to filter and generate ideas in sectors. We're trying to get five out of 10 right. That's the difference. We're trying to get five out of 10 right versus three out of 10 throwing darts at a board. If you have good risk management, you will make money over time with five out of 10, even four out of 10. <laughs> so uh, maybe Gregoire's group stay in here, my group go outside on the sofas or something. Go, go into another area so you don't hear each other coming up with ideas. If you want to take any position, you, you need to understand the world, you need to understand the, the market. So the basic of any, any, any filtering, first you start with the world, then you go into the filtering. So it's like taking a huge universe and scrolling down. This is it. At the moment, I'm just basically looking at a very localized, only areas that I'm specifically interested in. But now this thing is basically saying stop have a look at the bigger picture, then start working from that perspective. And it's, 
it's really helped me. No, it's a good group. It's it's working uh, very very well. You can see quickly that it's everything is clicking. So I'm 100 percent confident. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, it's great because from my position, I've done this many many times, taught thousands of people around the world, and when you have new fresh minds, new guys coming in, they're coming in as blank canvases. And from a professional trader's perspective, I know they know close or next to nothing about what's going to happen and the stuff they're going to learn about the financial markets in the next 10 days. By the time we get to the end of these 10 days, they're going to be so knowledgeable, they have no idea how knowledgeable they're going to be. We're looking for, we've been given a task to look for uh, long ideas. Uh, uh, so we're just going through that now, looking for in the service sector of the US and try and come up with a, a decent long idea to put to uh, Anton and uh, Gregoire. So we've got an hour to do it. So you know, we'll stick with the US uh, due to the PTM and just do the top-down analysis that we've been taught in the PTM. Uh, so yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's interesting. Yeah, today's been interesting. It's definitely refined everything that we've, uh, you know, we've been taught and uh, you know, a few other a few of the things that they've taught us as well to look out for, so it's been good. Uh, we are just logging into the Institute webpage and uh, uh, we are digging into the reports that uh, uh, they have been published with all the Excel files, so now we are trying to uh, um, extract the non-manufacturing numbers from the whole file, filtering through the Excel software. Here we go. Standard procedure. going to look for is the should be on here somewhere. Uh, the ISM non-manufacturing index, there you go. Because we are looking for a long idea, so we chose the non-manufacturing sector to look into it. Yeah. Do you have your, uh, give me your email. 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 So that I can send you the sector control. Okay, good first session guys. Uh, second session on Monday. First thing we will do is the uh, stock ideas and pictures and then we'll move on to macro in the afternoon. So we're going to head out for dinner now, a couple of minibuses taking us down uh, to the beach area and we've got a table booked for dinner. So let's move on.